Welcome to a brand new vlog. Today we are actually gonna go to Austin, Texas for a little family vacation. It was kind of just last minute. We don't even know what we're gonna do there. But we've been wanting to go to Austin just to check it out because we've heard that it's kind of like Seattle vibes and we're like, if we're gonna stay in Texas, we kind of want to look around and see, you know, what cities we like to raise our family. Now that we're gonna be a family of three, we really gotta be thinking about these things. I mean, ever since we had Victoria, right? But like even more now. It's already like five, so we're gonna get there super late. So right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pack, I'm gonna get ready. I already made the girls lunch, so they they should be good until later tonight. I'm not gonna do my makeup that much. I'm just gonna do some skincare. I'm using this little lotion, face lotion. It's called Glow. I like it a lot. I'm not usually into skincare, but lately I'm liking it. And I feel like with this pregnancy, my skin has just been glowing. Okay? Oh, Victoria said something. Yeah, I'm not even gonna do my makeup today. There's just no point because we're just gonna like get there and sleep. And then some eye cream. This eye cream has been so good. It's ginseng origin. I just, okay, look what I mean by why I like it. So it's eye cream, right? But it like really highlights, it brightens. Do you see that? It brightens everything. There we go, glowy skin. And I gotta get the girls ready. I already packed for them. I just have to get them ready now. Where are you, Victoria? What are you doing? Oh, you're eating a sandwich. Oh, you, f oh, you made a mess. Oh, that's okay. You ate all your sandwich. Good job. And this is my outfit of the day. Very mom vibes, you guys. I look like 10 years older in this dress, but it is so comfortable. I don't have a dress. You don't have a dress yet, but we'll, we'll actually, no, the girls are gonna go in pajamas. Cause like I said, we're not gonna do anything. So that's why I'm not dressing to impress. I'm just dressing to dress. And update on pregnancy. I'm 18 weeks. <sighs> Already running out of breath. I still get kind of nauseous sometimes. Even more when I talk about it like right now. Mm. I need a moment. <laughs> nauseous and very tired. Girls are crazy. Polita, do you have to poop? Yes, it caca? Poop. You want to poop? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And right now Enrique, is he just got off work, but he went to the store to get Victoria a little present. Dada. Victoria was good this week. He was going to get her pom-poms. And he went to go get a car seat for Olivia because Olivia is so big. Like she does not fit in her baby car seat anymore. So she needs a big girl car seat. <laughs> You want to see how the peanut toilet is a peanut toilet? What? It's not a toilet. A little girl toilet. It's a little girl toilet. Oh, shit. That was a fail. Okay, let's try this again, Olivia. Do you want a popsicle? Get it? I want the see? These are just so hard to open that that's why I dropped it. I got them these hats from TJ yesterday. They both love them. That's what they're gonna wear. That's their outfits of the day. Very comfy. That's finally home. Oh, no. ¿Te portaste bien? Mm -hmm. Sí. Wow. Do you want green or do you want blue? blue. ¿Cuál quieres? Azul? I want this one. Olivia, ¿también se portó bien? Sí. Olivia, ¿también o tú y también? ¿También se portó bien? ¿También? ¿También? ¿O también no? ¿También sí o también no? Let's see you cheer, Victoria. Go team! Go team! Go team! Wow! <laughs> Do you love them? Mm -hmm. Le gracias, papá. Thank you. No, si te porto mal te los quito, eh? Wow, Olivia. Wow, Olivia. Olivia. Bolita. Okay. Ahora, tu tarea, Victoria, <laughs> se, los que se caen, tienes que echarlos a la basura, ¿ok? Dang, look at Olivia go. She was looking at this picture so that she was doing that. <laughs> Is that Jojo? Okay. Henry was hungry, so I made him a quick sandwich. 
thank you. These pom-poms shed like every two seconds. And every time one sheds, Victoria brings it to me, which I appreciate because she's, you know, she's helping me. She doesn't want to make a mess, but it's pretty annoying. It's like every, as you can see, two seconds. Amazing. Best adventure I've ever had in my life. Maybe because I was that hungry. My dad came back from work. He brought Richard the man. Richard the man, yeah. And Enrique the man. Richard the man. Enrique's dad's name is Enrique, Richard in case you guys didn't know. That's the word, both Enrique the mm -hmm. Oh my god. Hurry up, I want to leave already. I know, me too, but I'm hungry. I'm going to stop at Waterburger. No, I don't eat Waterburger. Uh -huh. I'm fit. <laughs> As you eat Doritos. If you guys haven't followed me on Instagram, you definitely should because look. Premium quality. <laughs> and that's not the only one. He <laughs> Different angles. <laughs> Enrique is installing Olivia's first big girl car seat. Do you want to put this padding? Wow. Big girl seat. Como Victoria. Victoria, yo también queremos salir en la película. Victoria, sonríe para la cámara, ya, la cámara. Hola. Hola, hola. Así todos nos saludamos. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. <laughs> that, that's what Enrique had to grow up with. <laughs> After much, much time, we're finally on our way. Well, not even, not really. We're gonna get a car wash first. This shit's dirty. Yeah, like as you can see, the window is super dusty. So we're gonna go to the HEB wash. We just love HEB. Yes, we rep in HEB car wash, HEB fuel. Wow. HEB snacks. We're in the car wash. We're in the car wash. Quality content. Going to the car wash. We're in the car oh. wash, baby. For those of you who don't have a oh, car. Oh, we fancy. HEB fancy. Yeah, we're in the car wash. Look at the look on their faces. Prideless. We're one hour in on the trip. I'm giving the girls both a pouch because Victoria asked for snacks and she's been good. Olivia has been too, kinda. She cries here and there. Nothing a pouch can't be ex. You're kinda happy and he needs a pouch. You're happy because you got a pouch? That's good. Oh, Parker. <laughs> That was amazing. Who are you running from? Uh, a ghost. Uh. Ow, that hurt though. I mean, if it's Guess what, you guys? Guess what? Pit stop at Whataburger. It's like old times. And it's only 10.39. We're supposed to get there at 3. You excited about your burger? Kinda. I feel kinda weird, but I'll enjoy it. I think I'm just hungry. Limited edition Louisiana sauce. Whoa. Burgers. And you got a peppermint shake. Peppermint shake. Dr. Pepper Oh, shake. Dr. Pepper shake. We're looking for hotels. We're staying at New Brownfields because that's closest to Bucky's. Mm -hmm. We tried to go to Bucky's on our oh, way there. Oh, in the morning for breakfast. Yeah. Bucky's breakfast. If we go all the way to Austin, we're gonna have to go back and I don't wanna do that. Yeah. So, I just don't know which one. Probably wow. Motel 6 or something cheap. We'll see you guys at the hotel then. We made it to the Hotel Motel Quality Inn. Yay! <laughs> Ooh, smells like sacks in here. Oh, it's actually quite cozy. Uh, yeah. We weren't looking for anything fancy because we we're literally just going to sleep and leave at like 6 a.m. tomorrow. Are you pleased? I mean, I still feel innerly raped by oh. that freaking system. Oh, yeah. Nice. They gave him a... Well, we'll explain tomorrow, but this is not what he thought we got. <laughs> It's 9.48 a.m. Uh, the hotel was rather raunchy. Yeah, it was uh, 
for $130 and I could have gotten so many better. I think I was telling Curly, we should have, like Curly said, like we could have taken La Quinta at 70 bucks and we already know it's gonna be trash. This one was like, oh, it's a surprise and it was trash. So don't forget to do your fellow hotel dwellers a favor and remember to remove all of the covers and for pillows and whatnot. Uh -huh. I know you got, and I got an argument last night because of the hotel. <laughs> Not really an argument. Well, no. Tony was just giving me shit for like doing it, but I was like, I was like, dude, I'm driving. It's your job too. I was driving and actually looking for- No, you weren't. We were stopped. I, I know. Oh. No, you were eating. I was trying to eat. I just don't know which one. Probably Motel 6 or something cheap. Anyways, when we went over this, it was I'm driving and I'm paying. It was her job to look for a freaking hotel. Yeah, but I can't when when we're driving because I get super dizzy. That was her excuse, and she did say like, oh, when we're. Anyway, now we're heading to Austin. We're gonna see where we're, we're gonna have for breakfast. I have the address for Ride the Ducks. Oh yes, the Ride the Ducks. Quack, quack. You don't know what that is. I haven't been in a big city in a while. Yeah. again or what? how much of a success the hideaway kitchen and bar yes we're gonna stay uh, at a restaurant oh no did you take us to the quality inn again i see a quality inn over there yes wait is this the one yeah for real yeah so why did i do how did i do karini how did i do oh well, i don't know i guess we'll have to see inside is it, Ram is it ramana in ramana all right ramana okay, okay. this is our room Uh, so they don't have the keys. The rooms are not ready. It's 3 p.m. It's when it's supposed to be the check-in, but I guess the I guess the housekeeping ladies are lacking. No. So Enrique failed again. Better. Wow. Yeah. It smells clean. Good. Wow. You like you like your room, Lolita? Hello. Welcome back. I mean, it's the same day, but um, we just had a little refresher. We took a nap. We feel good. Well, we all feel good except Olivia. 
She always wakes up a little bit cranky after her nap. Enrique is on his period, so he's been crabby. Don't, don't lie. I've been pretty fucking cool. Don't he also lie. wakes up crabby from a nap. No, I've been really cool. It's just like Carney just keeps doing little super annoying things. It's like, it's like death by a thousand paper cuts instead of just like stabbing you right in the face at once that's what Karen's technique is mm, his feet are wet because of me somehow i let you use my sandals and you got them all wet that, that's not your sandals my sandals are over there i was gonna go in the bathroom because the bathroom is super wet because you got it super wet those sand but then you took a shower with them and those sandals yeah. were already wet yeah. When I went in the bathroom, they were already wet. I wouldn't need the freaking sandals to walk in the in the bathroom if you hadn't put it, uh, made it super wet. Oh, I don't know how to say it. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to the adventure. We're out of the hotel and we are getting some dinner. We are going to this place called 1618 Asian Fusion. It has Thai, Vietnamese, and dim sum. 4.7 stars. 4.7 stars. Over a thousand reviews online. People say it's worth the rave or whatever. And I think it's perfect because Enrique's craving dim sum. I am too, but I really want Thai food too. So it has everything. I know the 1618 will mean something about a year. It's just a place that are like, so this is a- Oh, the number? 1618. <laughs> yeah. Okay, 45 minute wait. We're gonna kill some time. We're just chilling. Apparently there's a park around here and Victoria is just, you know, representing recycling. Victoria? Olivia, I'm sorry. I already get him confused. We're such tourists. So in the meantime, we're gonna walk around like tourists do. Damn that ass. That ass is fat. And we got filas, you guys. What do you think about that? Isn't that like high school, middle school shoes? No. Men. We're halfway there. We got like over half. maybe like 20 more minutes left, so we came back to the car. It's been 30 minutes. It's been 30? Damn. 15 more minutes, supposedly. Yeah. And also, it's a good strategy because they make you get even hungrier. So oh, yeah. You actually get there, you order even more things. Even if it's one more appetizer, it's already. We're gonna order hella things. Yes. Yeah. I need my juicy pork yeah. buns. Ooh. Please don't get too close yeah. to my face. Why? I have an allergic reaction in my eye. Oh, hi. The drinks so far are phenomenal. So they don't struggle when I look at my gap. <laughs> See what I mean? I actually did you a solid and I took, a, I took one for the kids. She doesn't see it. She just thinks that I'm attacking her. You're like, they're going to be attacking my plate. I wonder why. Well, looky here. That looks beautiful. You look beautiful. Did we mention how good that restaurant was? I can't remember. Well, anyway, the restaurant we went to was amazing. Enrique. Stupid good. Probably my best, my favorite restaurant in the world, you honestly. I really loved it. I really liked it. If yes. you live in Austin or you visit Austin, you have to go. To 1618 Asian Fusion. It's so worth it. You're going to drop some cash, but it's worth it. It's so worth it. Seriously. Thank me later. Well, thank her because she's the one who found it. I picked it out. 
and, and then we're gonna go to TJ Maxx, which we have to hurry because they close at 9.30, it's like 8.50. You know how we like TJ Maxx and we cannot come to a different city and not check out their TJ Maxx. Yeah. Because they got different stuff. stuff. Yes, sir. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Good morning. This is our last day in Austin. Sadly, we do not want to leave, but you know we gotta we gotta face reality and go home. But before we go home, we're still gonna like try and explore a little. We're looking for a sugar daddy that can pay for our rent so we can move here to Austin. So if you guys are interested, or sugar mama, yeah, um, or sugar community. <laughs> Enrique is doing this thing again. I am housekeeper's best friends. Or worst friends, because maybe they didn't want to clean the sheets. Well, in that case, I'm other fellow hotel dwellers' best friends. <laughs> and I'm getting clean sheet. Ooh, we won't forget this guy. <gasps> oh my god. Victoria, you need to be on top of your toys. Think fast. <laughs> yeah. For breakfast today, what do you think we're going to have? Thai food, because as you know, McAllen has some of the worst Thai food I've ever had in my life. It's so, not Thai. It's not even Thai. It was it's like noodles made by a Mexican. It had and noodles it and gringo. just, it said it had veggies and it was just jalapenos. Like, oh yeah, try our veggies in our Thai. Your veggies are nothing but jalapeno and freaking. So racist just because we're Mexican. Yeah, it's like, oh, is this what Mexican veggies look like? Best Thai in a while. Like every restaurant that we've been to in Austin has been amazing. Um, and we gotta play with noodles and have the noodles are in here. Make sure like this. <laughs> All right, guys, we, um, what happened? What just happened? Oh, we're in the neighborhood think where the children's museum is, Thinkery. Um, and we fell in love with the neighborhood, you guys. It is so modern, so green. They have literally everything. They have a grocery, they have, oh, they had a farmer's market that we just went to and we got some cookies. Best cookies ever, look how big they are. They're so heavy, oh it feels God. like you bought butter only. Yes, I and butter. what else? And then Enrique got a coffee, but what happened, Enrique? I was like, how much is it? Five dollars, my fine sir. I was like, well, sir, I would like to pay with this debit card. He's like, oh, my kind sir, the machine is down. Will you happen to have any cash on you? I'm like, my dear lord, I do not have, I do not have no cash. I'm like, oh, well, for heaven's sake, this is on the house, my dear sir. Enjoy it. So, yes, they're very proper here. Yeah. <laughs> but no, it was really nice of them. Like, they just gave the coffee to him. Garnier was free. like, that will never happen in the valley. In like, McAllen? Hell like, no. Like, well, I got, this is Austin, Texas. What was the neighborhood called here? You Mueller. Said? Mueller. Mueller. Okay, if you're in Austin, come to Mueller. Now done at the Thinkery, our next tourist attraction is the Capitol. You can see it right there. That's and look the how one. green again. Um, there's a lot of protests going on right now. There's not, not a protest, that's just like a demonstration I think it's called. There's or maybe they're the same, I don't know. They're just people saying, uh, release Melissa Luna, what's her name? You said Lucio. Oh, Lucio. And then uh, Ukraine something. There you go, let's see. Do you hear it? But that's just how cities are. Protests everywhere. I wonder what they're trying to accomplish. Isn't this beautiful, you guys? 
And look at the beautiful um, man-made clouds in the background. You know how they say like the clouds are auto-generated or something like Auto-generated? <laughs> what are you even talking about? We're inside the capital. We made it through security. Da -da 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 -da. Wow. I feel like we're in it's a beautiful. Look at this. Wow. Now this is architecture. You see minimalist stuff nowadays, which is cute, you know, in its own way, but this takes skill. You can actually appreciate the details and know how many man hours came into the making of this beautiful piece. Uh, 1800s? Not sure. I don't think so. We'll find the history of it in Back a second. Back white wigs. Look, and we have... shortage crisis in the year 2021. We made it out of Texas, I mean out of Austin. Um, but before we go back to McAllen, we want to go to Bookies. But the girls knocked out because they were so tired from walking all day. So we're going to play one of their favorite songs. Olivia's favorite song in particular, so we'll see if they wake up. We're going to have to change the music though because yeah. it's copyrighted. Okay, let's see. Victoria likes the song, but not as much as Olivia. <laughs> now we're gonna put a song that Victoria likes. She's run away by Galantis. You have to put the part that she really likes. Bookies. We know it's Bucky's. She just called it Bookies. Yeah. And that's how you wake up your kids in a good mood. You put their songs on. And then you play with a little rabbit. <laughs> wow. Olivia, get in here. <laughs> guys, look at all this goodness. Junk food from Bucky's. Of course, the chopped brisket sandwich couldn't be left out. And more different chips and the beef jerky. And for some reason, I got um, mustard potato salad. Oh, shit. Oh, yes. I'm feeling the pregnancy. The pecans. Pecans. Currently, just, you know, she's in love with deals. I saw someone announce that pickle, and I want to try it. There you go. They said it's supposed to be really good. So now she's in the back feeding the kids. They're eating a turkey brisket sandwich and it's really good. It's so crowded back there because we just got Olivia, one of the big girl seats. Yeah. And Kearney can barely fit. It's time to get a mom van. Too big to fit in here. Ooh. No, but look at this. This is the best find. I don't understand. Like, Spicy pickled eggs. <sighs> la, 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 la. I'm not going to eat them right now. We just want to have them at home. We're going to have some lunch right now. Supper, dinner, whatever it is. I need my tums first. What? They ain't here? Do you move them? No. They're on here. I saw them. Of course you. Here you go. It's my dinner. Tum it up. So that was it for the end of our little vacation weekend getaway. This is the actual end of the vacation when we yes. drive back home. Yeah. So it's finally settling in. The sadness, the depression, the back to reality. Just no kidding. home starting at 1, 5, 80 a month. Okay. Um, but anyway, like our memory's running out of the battery, but we just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. That's the end of the video. We hope you liked it. We absolutely love taking you guys along with us to Austin, mm -hmm. um, our hopefully new home someday soon. We're and actually in this little town called New Brownfelds, and it's right in the middle of San Antonio in Austin. And I was telling Karen, it is pretty nice in here, and it's close to a bucky, so might as well, you know, we could look into yes. this area. I don't want to be so close to the city, but whatever. We'll see. Um, as Karen said, thank you so much for watching. 
was amazing. If you haven't commented in this video, please comment right now so the algorithm knows that you guys like this video and it gets promoted to other people like yourself. Yep. In the meantime, we love you so much. Bye. Bye. Can you see Victoria saying bye? Olivia, say bye. <laughs> They're both saying bye. <laughs> bye. That's so cute. They both say bye.